Welcome to Getting Started with Blackboard. This video tutorial will give you an overview of how to log in and navigate Blackboard to find important announcements and information, engage with material posted for your courses, and learn more about student services offered by Algonquin College. To log in, go to blackboard.algonquincollege.com and log in using your student network account username and password. On the home screen, you can see at a glance any recent announcements from your enrolled courses in this window here. Announcements could include reminders for due dates, instructions on how to be prepared for upcoming classes, and last-minute class cancellations. Scroll down the page a little to read announcements and messages for all Algonquin College students in this window here. These are college-wide notices about events, services, and important dates you might be interested in or find useful. The home screen is available at any time in Blackboard by clicking the Home tab at the top of the page. Let's take a second to view the other tabs available to students. Click the Courses tab at the top of the screen to view the list of your enrolled courses. If you don't see one of your courses, find out if your classmates are experiencing the same problem. If so, it may be that your instructor needs to be notified to make these courses available. If the problem continues, you may need to contact the Registrar's Office to confirm your enrollment in the course. Check the Blackboard Frequently Asked Questions for Students webpage by visiting www.algonquincollege.com slash blackboard slash FAQs dash for dash students. Finally, let's click on the Resources and Guides tab. On this page, you'll find Blackboard resources, online resources, a link to the prior learning assessment and recognition, a link to the current students portal, and a link to your email account. You will also find links to sections of the Student Survival Guide. I hope this video has been helpful to show you how to navigate Blackboard. If you still have questions about using Blackboard, watch the other videos in this series, or visit the Frequently Asked Questions for Students webpage mentioned earlier in the video. Thanks for watching!